Okay, uh, July 28, Monday, July 28, 2014. I was starting to walk around 3.30 and 3.38 on my friend, Louis. I, you know, he called me up and invited me for lunch. So I went to Casablanca already right now. And I ate some enchiladas with rice and beans. I'm sorry, it's not enchilada, but chile relleno. Chile relleno is like a, you know, it's like a vegetable with cheese inside of it. I order something that doesn't have any wheat on it. Because I noticed that when I eat any product that has wheat on it, it doesn't let me lose any weight. So, we had a nice talk there. And right now, I'm walking, it's kind of windy right now. But uh, I am walking right now, doing my route. See how I could do my stomach got, got kind of loose today. So, depends how my stomach behaves. I'll try to make a two hour walk. I already walked this morning. This morning I already walked for an hour. And I need my Tibetan exercises at the end of it. I walk out four. 47 and I went for an hour walk and I did my Tibetan exercise and I started working at 6 and so so far it's been a very successful day I wasn't planning on eating you know but my friend called me up and so I ended up having a lunch there but that's all I eaten today chile relleno with some cheese in it and beans and rice and I drank a little bit of water with it like about an ounce of water but other than that, because that's all they had, they don't have distilled water in the restaurant. So only about an ounce of regular water. And so the rest I've been drinking a lot of distilled water today. I wanted to cleanse that soup from yesterday. But remember, yesterday was 203. So I'm curious to see how we're going to be ready today to start the week. Praise God, you'll, the next thing you'll see will be the, the numbers in Rite Aid. So here we go. Check your weight and body mass index. Sit in the middle of the seat. Place both feet on the bar below. Press begin to get Great job! Here's your Higgy score. Want to track your Higgy score and stats? Click Save. You can see today's score is kind of interesting, huh? Uh, you can see, I, I drank a lot of water last night. I drank soup and all that, and the whole day I've been drinking. So, between last night when I drinking water until today, it's been about a, a gallon and a quarter of a gallon, I think, of it. So, you can see that a lot of liquid I put in me, and I also had like a, a whole 18, 16 ounces of a lot of that had a lot of this gas that was moving my body last night so I drank that with about one teaspoon of pink Himalayan salt you know to provoke some sort of diarrhea I didn't do that diarrhea until today I could go into the bathroom to the other time but at the same time I was drinking a lot of water so I think all of that contributes so there's a lot of liquids in me about a gallon of water piece yesterday to today so even though I walked this morning and I did my exercises and did all that the way they showed, as you can see, well, the blood pressure was all right, at 103 over 67, that's normal. The pulse was all right, 95, but the weight was 208, and that's 32.65, obesity. Okay, but that's the case today, because I drank a lot of water. You know, usually I was drinking about half a gallon, 
or less than a half a gallon a day. But because of how the way I felt, I told you on Sunday, I felt that discomfort. The only that I, I drank a lot of water to try to get that gas to come out of my system. But in any case, I've been peeing a lot of it today already. And I like a lot of uh, diarrhea kind of a day. That's why I couldn't do my two hour walk uh, or more. I did only about an hour and a half. And I had to go to the bathroom at Vons. You know, uh, I went to the bathroom at Casablanca, the restaurant my friend invited me. And so, but that's the case so far. So, but I'm not discouraged. I've seen this happen in the past. When I drink a lot of water, then the weight goes up. So, this is gonna easily go down again. So, we'll continue this week. And uh, still, my drink of choice is the still water. That's mostly what I've been drinking. I drank a lot of it, as I can like tell you, the last, since last night on today. But hopefully, we're gonna go to the regular intake that I've been doing the rest of the week. But that's what's going on so far. So praise God, I got to see my friend today. Uh, we had a nice talk. His, his business is doing pretty good. And so, and uh, the Lord gave me ideas on how to use his uh, invention too. So you just pray for, for me that I'll, the Lord will guide me there. But praise God, that's our results for today. And I just found out that I'm gonna be doing overtime tonight. They gave me thanks be to God, three hours of overtime for tonight, which I'm gonna start in about less than half hour. So that's why I'm not saying too much as a way of meditation. But tomorrow I don't have any work to do any overtime. So tomorrow I'll be able to to talk more to you about, you know, the benefits of living in the heritage for which you were created, which meaning the awareness of the word and the completeness that you find in that word of your maker. And how to present that word in a complete fashion here in this world. So, you know, the God will be proud of the way you bring his son out of your lips. So I'll be talking more about that. Uh, tomorrow, but I thought I should mention what's going on today. So praise God. Another day of victory, I believe. I did more walking anyhow. I got one hour in the morning and I did my Tibetan exercises and again I did my Tibetan exercises right now. Now this time, I did not know how to put the angle of the camera, so the exercises, I would, half of the, my waist it was not put down, so I did not add it to this. That's why, you know, because I'm trying to put it every Monday, just to show you an idea, but it's 13. Remember, there's five exercises. The first one is swirling around. Instead of 10 times like last week, we do 13 times this week, this whole week. You know, on all those, each one of those Tibetan exercises. If you want to remember what they are, I'm going to leave you to go see day one where I made a recording of it. I was going to put another one for this Monday, but I just noticed that the angle from which you were recording did not show the whole, the whole frame of my body so you could see all the exercises. So I'm omitting it from this presentation right now. I, if I have a chance, I'll try to do it tomorrow, but I'm not going to make any promises. Tomorrow, I'm going to basically uh, concentrate upon the messages that God is giving me to, to give about His Word and about His Son. But that's all for today, and so I'll keep you posted what's going on. God bless.